much. We've got loads of still, like loads, like this much. And it's it is like um, it's but it's alcohol and fragrance free. And I really like it when you can smell the alcohol because I just feel like it makes you feel like your hands are cleaner. But this just makes your hands sticky. It feels like a hand wash, doesn't it? Like you know, like that gel sort of feeling. You know. Um, because if you didn't know we went to Crufts and um, we got a few things um, and I'm really excited we haven't given out the dogs any of their treats or any of the treats we got yet because we wanted to do a video and we got back quite late last night so yeah basically so the first thing we got I can't remember what was this shop called where we got this from I'm not sure does it sound like is that what it was yeah Okay, so there was this stall and I don't want to try and pronounce it. La di da dog, la di da dog. So basically, we um, shave the dogs ourselves because it can get quite expensive because they need cuts quite a lot. And we've just um, cut Holly's hair really short again. So she, basically she needed a cut because it's been like six weeks or eight weeks before, after we cut them. So now we have cut them and she's shaking. We cut Millie as well, but for some reason she doesn't shake. It's just Holly, isn't it? Yeah. She gets really, really shaky. So we saw this and it's like, it's not just like a jumper. It's got like legs on it as well because the legs can just shake. And she does it when she's in my, because they sleep in my room. She does it when she's in there, even though she's under the covers. She just shakes. Mm. no clue why but this is really good it's like you know those fleecy tops you get not something like this but what's it called this this material it's a, a thick fleece like it? fleece yeah so it's like this and yeah i really like the green one but obviously mum picked it so yeah, but I actually think this does suit Holly more than the green one would have. It's a little bit baggy, but we can't take it back and it'd just be a big palaver. So, yeah. So, the next thing we got is these detangling and dog grooming brush. It's, it says Battersea at the bottom. I don't know, like, I don't know why. But they had all different types of what for different dogs. So, you could get a large one. Um, I think this was basically eight a pounds. Teaser basically a tangle dogs. teaser for dogs, and um, we asked, and they are different to the tangle teasers we have. So this one is for light shedding, wiry, and fine-haired small dogs. That is our dogs because they don't shed the at all. We have to shave. Come here, baby. Come here. So yeah, yeah, basically. Away from me because I started Holly, come here, let me show you my bobbins. This is the one that needs the cut, by the way. 
at you. At you, little cutie. She's wanting to come up because you can smell the treats in the bag. Can't you? I'm not sure what the Tangle Teaser feels like. I don't know if it's like a rubber material. I'll get it out. Oops, what should I just do? She's going to run away soon because she'll know. I'm going to, I'm just trying to open it. I'm never, I don't know if anybody else is like this. Uh oh, she knows it's a brush. Oh, it just feels like a Tangle Teaser but a bit softer. So, quite good actually. But I'm not hurting you, am I? So yeah, you put your hand in here. You can like push your dog. Oops, oops, bags, bags. So yeah, this is it's called Pet Teaser. It's recommended by Battersea. If you didn't know what that was, it's just like a rescue. Um, we watch the show online uh, on ITV. I think it is Battersea. So. My gosh, why is everything falling down? So then we got a leaflet for Digby and Fox. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's coats. We got one of these. The reason why we didn't get Millie one of these was we we just didn't think she'd need it because she does have a coat already. And obviously we got this because Holly shakes. And we also got it as like an anxiety coat. Oh, Betty. Oh, okay. She's running. That's my cat. Um, so, all right, Rico. Also, Holly does have quite bad teeth. It's not because we don't brush them. It's not we do brush their teeth. It's not because of anything that we could help. She has an undershock jaw, which her teeth are... I don't want to shove her face in there, and I don't want to be mean. But she has an undershock jaw, which means your teeth aren't aligned like, like that. So, basically, she just has really bad teeth, and we always give her chews because that seems to help. So, we saw this... Rico, that's the bird, if you couldn't tell, of course you would. So this is wood and it's completely safe. It's not like what you get from parks and things. It's a 100% natural dog chew. I think it's, I think it's um, coffee wood. I'm not 100% sure, but I let her sniff this, which is a little bit mean, but I let her have like a look because we weren't, we were, we was not sure whether this would be, like Holly would like it but she does it's like I don't know if you can see it's very it's very hard so and it, it does not splinter it's completely safe no sharp edges it's all really smooth can I hold this can I have it and then these are what they really want they're these yak so they're not like any meat or anything they are yak yak which are natural Himalayan. If you don't know what yaks are, they're like, I think they're like boars. Oh, no, 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 not boars. Like big cows like these that live in the Himalayan. And it's their milk made into a chew. So it's not like any bone or anything. Um, it's really good for them. It's really hard. This is a, I think this is a small. No, let's get them. But we got these for one of the dogs. Um, if you can see, Mason really wants one, don't you? So, yeah, basically, yeah. They are slightly on the pricey side. I think they were like three, four. I'm not 100% sure. I'll have to ask my mum. But, Mason, come on, get down. Come on, bye. <laughs> anyway, so, yeah. Um, we also got this little box which you get like little um testers in there like a box full of testers i did open it because i was just really curious last night to see what was in it but honestly this is a really good deal it's by i think it's just called switch to fish so it's just like a fish brand which is all fish it's all really good treats it's nothing like artificial or anything like it's just fish basically that's what they're trying to say so it tells you what sort of things to get at the back i'm sorry if the bird's annoying you it tells you what you get at the back but i'm just going to open it it makes a really want it we will let him have some treats at the end but basically it's a big box this was whoa five pounds which is extremely cheap i don't know if, if it's just like a show price or they do them online for like cheap as well so this is a tester of food rico this is 
like a test of food. So it's their fish for dogs, um, finest. They've got some dry food. It's just like a tester that you'd get. Um, they, we have three of these of different flavours. So there's white fish and potato, which is really good for sensitive stomachs. It's grain free. All of them are grain free. Sardine and sweet potato is also good for um, like stomachs and then this i think they're all good actually i think they're actually all good for um sensitive stomachs because um because they have got salmon and sweet potato is really good and potato is good as well so this is one plus year is what they do do a puppy box which you could get if you have any puppies so we have three of these and then we have these which you get three in there these are like little you can see the like little cubes of fish and you've got two packs of these so we'll probably give some to betty i know they play just for dogs but they're fish and we do we did get betty some treats not that long ago that were like this so and then which is a bit weird these right these white fish sausages you'd think that these would be meaty but it's literally just white fish like sausages so you could like split these into four or six maybe if you want them as like little treats. And then the last thing we got was a pack. These, I think these are actually a, just a normal pack, like the size you would buy. Um, this has got a bulldog on it. They are training treats. So, Betty, what are you doing? She really likes that wood. Don't you, Betty? Don't you? She likes the wood, but she can't have it. Um, you could have one of these, Betty. And then also, Betty, come on. Away from the camera. Betty. Come on. Come on now. Betty. Um, and then we got this, which you can get a free 1.5 kilogram bag of complete food. Um, so you just, like, put this in. Um, yeah. That is really good. Betty come, Betty come on, I don't know if you can see her but she's right next to the camera, uh, Betty, anyway I don't know if you've got anything, oh yeah we have, we've got some left, so another shop which we saw was called Carney Love, Carney Love, I think that says Carney Love, I'm not 100% sure, Rico come on now be quiet, so I don't know what, they, oh they're going to look like that, so they're going to look like little little chuck chicken drumsticks they're quail and oregano they're like soft as well they're not like really hard um we got a few flavors of these so we got the quail we got the trout and we got the blueberry one so i think that's a bigger pack it looks like it's a bigger pack but they're the same size of food so yeah that is really good um, I think that's it actually guys so yeah that's everything we got yesterday um, it was the best honestly I want to go back as soon as possible like I know they only do one a year but I really just really want to go back like I wish they did one every week honestly it's so good because they have the show rings you can go and like look around and watch the dogs do like agility and things and um we saw a dachshund show um we didn't see many shows actually because um we wanted to look around stalls and things and we didn't really know where everything was so yeah i think that's it now so oh i will i don't know anyway i might put a clip in of the dogs trying what we got then if i do if i don't then it might be in a different video i'm not sure but thank you guys so much for watching bye anyways sorry about that guys i wanted to show you something we just got betty some from this fish for dogs but this is the fish for cats range we got her some sardine and mackerel like a little tin you get um sad uh, sardine with mussels and tuna fillet with seaweed don't know I feel, how i feel about that one but do you like the smell of it can you smell it anyway guys thank you guys so much for watching this video bye